of the things I've discovered in my own mixing practice is the difference between mixing warm primaries and cool primaries together to make either a clear orange or a dirty orange or a clear green or more of a dirty green or clear purple or more of a dirty purple and you'll see what I'm talking about when I mix. So I'm going to start out with cobalt blue as being the base of all of the blues. It's, it's the truest blue. It's neither warm or cool. It's right in between. The first green I'm going to mix is with a warm yellow. So I'm mixing a warm yellow with the blue, which is somewhere between cool and warm. And so I'll mix about the same amount of yellow into it. It's a pretty color. It's sort of like a sap green. But you'll see what happens when I mix the cobalt with a cool yellow, which is the Hansi yellow light. See the difference between the warm, this is a cadmium yellow medium, and this is a Hansi yellow light. And take the cool yellow and mix it with the cobalt. And I'm getting a clearer green uh, as opposed to a green that is more of a muted green. This is a, a brighter green, this is more of a muted green. Simply by mixing a warm yellow with a cool color, a cool yellow with a cool color. So we're going to move on to purple. I'm going to mix a cool red with the blue. And that makes a very luscious purple. I'm going to put just a little more blue in here. One of my favorite colors. And then I'm going to mix the blue with cad red medium and cobalt. I need a little more blue here. And see, it's really more of a maroon, which is a more muted purple. It's almost like a brown purple because I'm using a warm red with a cool blue, a neutral color blue. And this purple is with a cool red and a cool blue. So it's a truer, clearer, brighter purple. So you can mix both depending on what it is that you're going for. And, and I do. That's the little story about mixing warm and cool primaries together. <laughs>